Hey guys, it's Jeff from Hookah Time. Say, I have El Fokker Peach here. I can't believe I've never done a review on it. I've looked through them all and I've never done an AF Peach. Um, it's a tangy, kind of sour, strong peach flavor. Um, it's kind of, if you're looking for an all around peach, this is the flavor you should get. It doesn't have any mixes with it, um, but it is a great solid flavor. It's El Fokker, it's affordable, and it has great clouds. So, so my setup is I have a Guru hose, a French tip hose, a Mini Beast by KM, a, the hookah time drip catching bowl, the HTDC. Um, it has the the cage uh, design in it. Uh, it's I guess it's considered more of kind of a vortex if you want to put it towards something. Then I have the uh, Cloud Lotus here. I'm using two titanium coals, Hedgestone, and the vent completely shut. I find that two coals that are Hedgestone inside of the Cloud Lotus is sufficient enough to keep your bowl going for a long time. It's enough heat, um, you're not wasting any of the coals, and it's a constant heat. So I've always just kind of preferred two. Some people use three, um, and then they just manage the vents a little bit more. Um, I just like two enclosed and uh, good to go. The peach flavor does last a long time, so you're gonna be able to go through a couple rounds of coals. Um, it's a nice, strong, sour peach flavor. Um, it's refreshing. I like it. So the bowl's been going for about 45 minutes to an hour now. Um, the coals are still nice and hot. The bowl's still going fresh. It's The str flavor's strong, and it's still a nice, strong peach flavor. Um, just kind of like the core AF flavors. You can't go wrong with mint, peach, vanilla, uh, I like their banana. Some people don't, um, but I like I like their banana. Uh, El Fokker, it does have the it does have somewhat of a buzz to it. It's not a strong Tangiers buzz, but it's not a weak Star Buzz or a Haze Buzz. I think it has an, a good enough kick to it if you're new to hookah. Um, but if you smoke hookah a lot, you aren't going to get that buzz from it. And then you, if you're chasing the buzz, then you're going to have to move up to the Nirvanas, the Tangiers, and so on. Um, but for a day-to-day -day smoke, um, just for chilling, watching movies, it's a great, great flavor. Uh, you can't go wrong with it. So that's my take on AF Peach. I think it's a very solid flavor. I can't believe I haven't reviewed it any earlier. Um, I smoke it a lot. I've gone through 250s all the time, um, but it's just a standard flavor. You can mix it with other fruits. It mixes well with any of the fluff pack shishas. Uh, so your Fumaris, your Haze, Starbuzz, and other alfalfa flavors, uh, it works well with. So give it a try. Um, let me know what you think. So this is Jeff from Hookah Time. Later.